What's up, Faith Family? Drivers Gone Void, Drivers YT here, and today uh, we're going to be taking a look at the comments of this Deadline Hollywood article. Now, uh, I was just reading about this this completely <laughs> normal event that occurred after a completely normal inauguration like two years ago, and <laughs> I just came across this absolutely psychotic comment section. These, This is some of the most demented stuff that I've, I've ever read in my entire life. And it's under an article about a completely normal inauguration television special. I mean, fairly normal at least. This event does not justify comments like this, so we're going to be going over these today. This is probably more suited to my other channel, but I said, you know what, fuck it. Just wanted to get this out quickly, so here you are. So first up, we have a comment by Tom Payne who has a link right here to a website called gofyourself.com and when we go to that it it has this stupid fake website stuff welcome by what the fuck is this I, I don't know this has got to be a russian bot or something but he said hail to the new corporate big tech domestic secret police state a fitting piece of propaganda mr hanks the new fascism a fitting finale to a massive rigged fraudulent election in which the winner was dismissed summarily and whose followers will now further be insulted by the kangaroo impeachment court of their new unifier their new dear leader now the new terror begins against those 80 million citizens who are vile enough to have not chosen this sick joke of a new leader by the new domestic order <laughs> the victim complex on this guy is, is absolutely unreal <laughs> why would you say something like this why would you embarrass yourself in public like this you know and why are you actively seeking out articles about a television special about an, about an inauguration that you feel was fraudulent where's the logic in that I'm going to sit down with Tom Payne for as long as it takes for him to explain to me why he was you know looking up articles about you know this this the sham this was a fake event in his eyes because the election was rigged you know i'm sure he's still seething mad he's probably crapping himself with anger right now then someone replied 80 million far from it that's why he lost it was closer to 73 second place move on oh, thank god we got some finally got some smart people in deadline hollywood comments from abt we have the fbi warned of attacks in dc and state capitals there were none not so much as a hurled soda can. There were barely even protests. Just a few lost-looking old men. Okay. See, all we had to do all along was just shoot one unarmed woman, and the whole movement would have collapsed. If only we'd known four years ago. We could have avoided all this unpleasantness. Now, I have no idea what the hell they're talking about, but that is absolutely psychotic. Why would you say something like that online? Why would you type that to where the feds can see everything you're doing? They can see everything you're doing, and you decide to put that absolutely unreal i mean in fact you have to leave your email address if you want to like actually leave a comment on deadline hollywood so they have your email they have everything <laughs> and you decide to you and you decide to post that and also where he says just a few lost looking old men let's not pretend trump isn't a lost looking old man especially nowadays just rambling on and on in his stupid i guess press conference he did after he got arrested man isn't a messiah the man isn't a martyr he's a criminal Anyway, up next we have Rick Jameson, who has a really, I guess, Redditor comment here. Where he says, where can I get it back? <laughs> Quickly, please. I don't want a projectile all over the place. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, Leave, Leave the one, too. I'm hoping the ending comes quickly. Bothing more I can't stand to see is a villain turned into an a hero. <laughs> What's worse is it's prevented by someone that also has no sense of truth. Tell me, Mom, did you happen to ask Beijing Biden? Why was he stopping work on the border wall? <laughs> <laughs> How about when two conversations <laughs> he volunteered what looks real? Two real statements. And, and I think it cut off. I don't think he could say any more than that. Um, this person is obviously mentally ill. So <laughs> I think we're going to be moving on. <laughs> anyway, anyway. Oh, yeah, we had another one here by Lex. 25,000 military celebrating a small politician is more like an inaugural ball in North Korea. <laughs> Okay, okay, well, <laughs> well said, well said. Anyway, I think we only really had uh, four comments, four psychotic comments on this article. Um, honestly, this is about 13 more comments than, than we usually see on Deadline Hollywood articles, but I, I, just, I just wanted to read through these because this is absolutely psychotic.
But I, I just don't understand some people. The government can see everything you put online, everything you do online, and you decide to put this garbage out there. Are you serious? You know, comments like this, comments like this, you know, you are making yourself a target for that. You are allowing yourself to become a, stata a, a stochastic terrorist. Jesus, that's really all it is. But either way, I'm Jarvis God and the Voyager RSYT. Thank you all for sitting through this. Um, barely going to edit it, so it's probably not going to make much sense. But... Um, either way, thank y'all for watching. Take care. More normal videos coming soon. At least we're hoping.